reporting for Canyon's News. I'm Sydney Roddy with the latest News Micro. Firefighters work to stop the Jake fire from spreading any further. Following the tragic passing of George Floyd, many Americans have become upset with the injustice that's present in his death. They have started to use their voices by protesting. One took place here in Santa Clarita Valley on May 30th off of McBean and Valencia Boulevard, as well as in front of the police station. Many citizens of all ages and cultural backgrounds stood chanting Black Lives Matter, and it was a peaceful protest. Sheriffs were present and no one was hurt or arrested, but another protest is being scheduled to take place at the same time and same area on June 4th of 2020. Golden Valley High School senior Starlin Hartnack is spreading kindness through the act of decorating graduation caps. I've been trying to cheer people up any, every day in whatever way I can, whether that's giving care packages or just having a nice conversation, letting people know they're appreciated and that you're there for them. With a quick meetup at a coffee shop or a swift drop-off, her classmates give her their caps along with what they want her to paint. Each design, I either make myself custom based on what the people request or I copy a picture that they send to me. I can work with pretty much anything. Her artwork and contact information can be found on Instagram at artsy underscore echnoderm. And she says there is no deadline and she will continue painting for anybody who wants their caps decorated. Since schools have been shut down and moved to remote learning, it has taken away from many experiences and opportunities for seniors. Senior Madison Roche was looking forward to her final show choir competition season in hopes of having a happy ending to her senior year, but because of the pandemic, she has to have her final choir experiences through Zoom calls. For the online graduation with choir, um, we put together a song for it, and I have a solo in it, which made me really happy because even though I don't get to perform for show choir anymore, that's like my final performance in a way. Another Saga singer, Nick Schioli, has a positive outlook on how to make something good out of a bad situation. He plans to focus his academic goals and hopes to see a positive change come from this. Both students say that they know all of their peers will come out stronger because of the situation. There will be a drive through graduation as well as a virtual presentation to celebrate their accomplishments. With the spring semester coming to an end and stay-at-home orders still in place, students who are in need of certain credits to graduate are scrambling to find a solution. It is in question whether or not internships will be held or if they will be waived for the fall. This applies to MEA majors including journalism, culinary arts, and film. Student Jasmine Flores is supposed to be graduating and transferring this spring as a film major. However, she says that in order to earn her degree, she must have an internship. And because of social distancing, it has been a challenge to find one. Although she says that the internship department has been helpful with sending students emails, she believes that waiving internships would benefit those who don't have the necessary resources to obtain these internships. That's all we have time for. I'm Sydney Roddy reporting for Canyons News.